Today is the day you will lose fat. Come see Dr. T at NJ Diet. Easiest diet I've ever done. It's changed my life. Come see Dr. T. Using blood work and DNA testing. 1-855-5-NJ-DIET and njdiet.com. Change your life in only 40 days with NJ Diet. Sitting to my left and Bernie's right is the funniest comedian. Uh, has been for a very, very long. No disrespect to the rest of the guys. that We, we love them all. And we have them all in here. But the guy to our left happens to be our favorite. He'll be at Caroline's coming up on Thursday night. And that is the brilliant Gilbert Godfrey. Yeah. Hamburger. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hamburger. So, but here's what's great about you, Gilbert, is you've been on my shows and on with me and Bernie about a thousand times over the last ten years. Even in Miami, you would do Gulfstream Park. You would stop by my studios about a thousand times over the last ten years. Let me take you back to three weeks ago. Yeah. I'm walking down 7th oh, Avenue. Oh, jeez. Mm-hmm. I'm walking oh, down 7th oh, Avenue after a nice lunch. And who comes walking right towards me but Gilbert and his lovely wife, Dara, who I have. She's a great, great girl. And what's great about you is it doesn't matter, Gilbert, how many times you're yeah. in here. Every time I see you, it's like the first time we Yes. Met. Yes. No. <laughs> it, that's, that's, I, I, I can never, I don't know why, mental problems. I, I could, I could have been living with you for the next 50 years. And if we go outside the apartment and I see you, and yeah. it's like, yeah, hi. Yeah. <laughs> So it's like that. I shouldn't take it personal. Like, well, no, how it's no. would be the same thing. This, this is. I, I, I did an episode of that show, Crashing, and so oh, with all your line, right? Yeah, yeah. And some guy comes up to me and he says, "Hey, you're great. You're you're doing great on this show. I, I, I really am glad you do." And and I, you know, I go, oh, yeah, thank you, yeah, thanks. And and I'm looking the other way, like this is some schmuck sure. saying, oh, you did another. Was, was, was it Joe Babatow? Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, he not- he looks at me and he kind of points to himself and he goes. Judd Apatow? And I go, oh, oh, yes, of course. Of course. I believe that. Yes. A thousand percent believe that. Yeah. You seem it, a little, little preoccupied. Yeah, it's ridiculous. It's uh, like I, I, George Clooney could come up to me. It wouldn't, wouldn't matter. It yeah, wouldn't matter. Your Judy. wife could come up to you. Yeah, so, yeah, honestly. exactly. Yeah. Hey, yeah. So, so we've been talking about the uh, NCAA tournament, the big college basketball tournament. Are you into this? I, yeah, oh, sure. <laughs> you seem like you seem yeah. like a guy. That's, uh, yeah. What college did you go yeah. to, Gilbert? I didn't go to college. Really? Uh, no. Yeah, you're talking to a complete idiot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I know that, but I mean, I'm talking yeah. about you, not Sid. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't need college. He was too smart for college. Yeah, that's, yeah, I, that's I it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you missed out on all that Heine. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, oh, my God. So <laughs> did you get a lot of Heine in college? Oh, man. It was just <laughs> throw, it was falling out of my, uh, like Eddie Murphy said, it was falling out of my pocket. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Left and right. Yeah. <laughs> no, I got nothing. Ne- oh, yeah, that would have been me in college. <laughs> <laughs> I got squat. Well, I got rejection. So in the street, you wouldn't recognize somebody, but, and this goes back to uh, something horrific I've been through just recently at this comedy club. We'll be on Thursday, so I'm not going. Uh, I love you, don't get me wrong, but I can't yeah. go back. I can't go back. Uh, Greg Charles knows about this. It's a, it's, a, it's a long story, but Kevin Nealon was here a couple of yes. weeks ago. And he was on with me and Bernie, like you're on with me and Bernie. Yeah. And he's been on a couple of times just like you. Yeah. And he loves it. He tells Greg Charles, these guys are great. They're next to Stern, ba ba ba. He's having a laugh. And he invites us on his stupid hiking show on the YouTube channel. Loves us. Yeah. So I go with my wife to go to a, see his show at Caroline's. And I'm sitting right in front of him, center seat, right by the mic. Yes. Just begging Gilbert for him to acknowledge me at some point during the show. Do you know that son of a bitch never mentioned me once? <laughs> now would you do that? See that would that would be me. <laughs> I I would I would be on stage going but, why why is this schmuck staring at but me? But see you but yeah. your, your your excuse is different. You would just not, you would be oblivious to who the yes, hell he is. Yes. But but Kevin Neal knows damn well who he is and I, was. I would be looking at him going, Oh God, what's right. what's wrong with that guy? Leave me alone <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. 
<laughs> so you don't do that. You don't work with them. But you do work with the crowd at some point, right? Uh, well, I, 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 late in my career, I finally realized, oh, you're, you're supposed to acknowledge someone in the crowd. Right. Who's, yeah. So you probably say, like, like call some lady the C word, because you're really a very filthy uh, yes, guy. Yes, right. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I remember we brought him up for the uh, one of the first events I did here, Bernie, when I moved back to work with you. We did this huge event at uh, the New York Yankee Steakhouse. Leslie Slender put on a great yeah. event. We had Chance Palmer, Terry stop by, and form, former football players, and, and Gilbert mm-hmm. was kind of to come by with his wife, Dara. And they go, listen, listen, it's a different type of crowd. I know what you say on stage here. <laughs> Whatever you do, don't curse like that here on stage. Right? He gets up there. And he maybe he was up there for two minutes. He must have said the C word 50 times. <laughs> 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 right away goes, Can I tell you the joke about the, the lady that C word. Oh, yeah, no. Uh, oh. Yeah, to, to me, I say it so often that it's, <laughs> I, I don't even realize. But that's, that's an old story. Bad. When people tell you not to do stuff, yes. that means you're going to go ahead you and gotta do uh, it. Yes. Like David Hasselhoff wants or something. Don't, don't oh. talk about. You know, oh, that, yes, yes. That? They said don't do jokes about, because, um, yeah. Pamela uh, Anderson. Pa- Pamela Anderson yeah. just agreed at the last second to do it. So they said, you know, go easy on Pamela. <laughs> don't do jokes. And, and all I started doing then was jokes about how stretched out her vagina was. <laughs> <laughs> and how, oh how it gosh. was like one of those inflatable men at the used car lot. <laughs> That's <laughs> you, need to, you need to be a spelunker yes. to, to get in that thing. Yes. No, well, that's your thing. You're politically incorrect, obviously. Yes. And that's, that's why people love you. Yeah. Uh, and some people hate you. You got any yeah. good Ethiopian jet crash jokes? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what's funny about what you just said? He was here one day before a train disaster. Remember the train disaster? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. People yeah. died. And we had to cancel. We had to cancel. He goes, we were forced to cancel. Right. Yeah. And on the way out, he goes... What a shame. I got great train disaster jokes. <laughs> <laughs> and then we, we really regretted it. Right. We're like, oh, what a big uh-huh. mistake. <laughs> there is nothing that you won't talk. There's nothing. The Holocaust. Yeah. I mean, nothing. Yeah, right? a- anything. You don't draw the line anywhere. No, no. Nothing. <laughs> no. Michael so, Jackson, pedophilia. Oh, gee. You know, that, that's, and now people are acting shocked. Right. I, I love that. That's the yeah, thing. Right. People, oh, he right. he had, to, he was doing something with those little boys. Right, right. that he was that sleeping he with. slept yeah. with, right. yeah. Well, well, you're not, the milk you're the not shocked because you slept there. Yeah, right. yes, yes. <laughs> I, when I was two, I, <laughs> I was dating. I know, all these funny. <laughs> of course, we're talking to Gilbert Godfrey. He's going to be at Caroline's Thursday night at 7.30. Yo, I, I did read that you're a little pissed off you're not in the, the remake of the movie no, Aladdin. No, they, they make it like I'm more like people tweeting me. You were in the first movie you played the voice of Iago, I believe yeah. it was, right? Oh, yeah. People are, are tweeting me and they, they're angry and I retweet them because, oh. you know, I like seeing my name. <laughs> uh, <laughs> where, where it's something in support of me rather than an attack. Right. And now they spread this whole thing like, oh, Gilbert's enraged. <laughs> and I sure, thought, sure. You know. It makes for yeah. good headlines. Yeah. When yeah. was the last time something really got you pissed off? Like, I, I can't imagine anything would, but what the, how uh, do you when, time? When you were looking at me <laughs> at, <laughs> at the last show. When, when we told you you have to come in and you can't <laughs> yes. call in. Yes. <laughs> Hey, listen, you, you just wished uh, Jerry Lewis a happy birthday. Now, he was known as a real prick. Uh, yeah, that's, I'm, I'm lucky that I can use that great line of, well, he was always nice to me. Uh-huh. You know, which nice. is, uh, whenever right. they, you hear that line, right. that means the guys are prick. <laughs> yeah. but, but in it's like I didn't really know him uh, well enough for him. But, uh, you know. He so I can't say he was always nice to me, but mm-hmm. I've I've heard stories. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, oh yeah, well, the, he's legendary for being. A, it's on tape. You see what a he's jerk a he was. Oh guy. yeah, oh. I I remember I met that actress, uh, uh, Kathleen Freeman. Oh sure. Yeah, and and I said, you know, she was. I I said I always see you in the Jerry Lewis movies. And she said, well, he was, you know, nice to her. Right. And he always liked, he, he had this set group. He put in all those movies. And I said, 
I I heard uh, he's the most hated man in show business. <laughs> and, and her face just kind of scrunched up, and she did this painful nod. Like, uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. But, yeah, yeah. You, you know, Adam Sandler once, uh, he walked up to Rodney Dangerfield when he first met him. I guess yeah. over in Dangerfield. And he yeah. goes, Mr. Dangerfield, you're my idol. I love you. I think you're the best. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Rodney Dangerfield turned around and said to Adam Sandler, he says, what do you want me to do, a cartwheel? And, and, and he, he, turn, he turned around... He grabbed his drink. <laughs> <laughs> but was that the way you would tweet some young budding comic who loved you? Would you uh, be? Yes, yes, yeah, yes. yeah. That that that's a great line. <laughs> <laughs> did you love? You knew Rodney, I guess. Well, right? You did cocaine together and uh, stuff. Yo, right? all the time. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I see. I, you, oh, go ahead. Go, go. No, I heard. I heard. Uh, uh, one time, I think Billy Crystal. Uh, saw Orson Welles somewhere, and uh, and he said, uh, "Mr. Welles, I'd like." And he goes, "You'd like to tell me that I've a, I'm a genius and I've changed the face of cinema." And uh, why don't you go bleep yourself? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he was like, aye, aye, aye. "Yeah, there's a fat a hole." <laughs> yeah, yes. <laughs> uh, but you're not like that. I mean, when people will come up to you Thursday at Caroline's and express their love for you. You're a relatively genial guy. You'll say thank you. Yeah, right? yeah. No, you won't. No. And I'll and I'll no. go. Hey, what do you want me to do? Do card <laughs> drills? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, that's a, I'm going to start hilarious, using right? that line. Use it. What's that's he going to do? He's funny. dead. What's he going to yeah, do? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, by the way, I want to ask you before you, the, the haircut. I mean, it looks like uh, you're into the neo-Nazi skinhead look. <laughs> little bit. Little bit. Or are you yeah. trying to fit in with me and Sid? Right. Little bit. Little bit. <laughs> little bit. Little <laughs> bit. <laughs> <laughs> no, you look good, though. Thank God. You're working you out again, obviously. Uh, yes, yes. Yes. Go punch me as hard right. as you can. You want to yeah. cool down with the steroids, <laughs> uh, So what do you expect from this crowd on Thursday night? What, what are you uh, nothing. Mean? Oh, I should tell you, mm. though, uh, out of my million plugs, mm -hmm. uh, I'll be, I ha I'm on this thing now called Cameo. And you could go to Cameo.com and get a video shout-out for me. Oh, cool. cool. Yeah. Cameo.com. And, and everyone seems like they write reviews of me afterwards, and, and they've all said the same thing. They go, hamburger. You know, they, <laughs> so are, uh, you the, yeah. are you the only person doing this Cameo thing, or is there other people? No, there's, there's other yeah. people. Oh, oh, Brett Favre. Oh, Brett Favre. Brett, yeah, he got in Gilbert, trouble. at this rate, you're 15 minutes away from blowing horses at the circus for extra cash. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's uh, funny. I mean, you're right there. I, I, well, it's just like I remember growing up watching Hollywood Squares. Sure, Paul. And and I would watch that and go, you know, I, I, you know, it it was very entertaining and I laughed and everything. But I remember always thinking, this is at the bottom rung of show business. <laughs> yeah. And then, sure enough, years later, they called me. And then <laughs> then I was, every time they called me, I said, oh, I'm going out to do another Hollywood. <laughs> and, and so you, you, you find out as time goes on. Right. Yeah. It, it's, it's like, uh, you, know, you know, when you start out, you go... Mm, I don't know. I, don't I want to so. co-star with Al Pacino. Sure. Well, he's he not as big as he wants. Yeah. And, would, and then, like, they give you a sandwich board right, and say, nice stand sandwich. on the corner. It was either that or Dancing with the Stars. Basically, you, right? uh, yes. That yes. would have been funny. You know, Paul Lynn was gay, right? Uh, no. He was? Yeah. <laughs> hey, <laughs> last one. What do you have in common with Jeff Sessions? Je no, I don't know. You were both fired by Donald Trump. Oh! That's right. That's right. <laughs> That's and, funny. Yeah, it, you know what's PFI. funny with Paul Lynn and Charles Nelson oh, Riley. Yes, yes, yeah. And it was that was back in that time when you go, oh, he's eccentric. Right. Yeah, right, right, yeah. Right, 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 you right. didn't think in terms of gay. You That's, thought, oh, he's so eccentric. You're right about that. Absolutely right. Sure, and sure. They, they, actually, they were both. When you think about it, they yeah. were. They, I mean, they were. They were odd and gay at the same time because that's what made them uh, so lovable. I guess. And, and they used to always cash them with a wife and kids. Right. I know. Yeah. Which, and you know, it's hard bye to bye believe. Bye bye, Bertie. That was really yeah. good acting. Yeah. Right. Very yeah. good. Uh, we got to run Gilbert Thursday night. Caroline's on Broadway. Always brilliant. You're great here. Thank you. Oh, thank, thank you. We thank love you. you. We love you. Yeah. Thank you. And you are again. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> I'll see you Thursday night, or maybe not. <laughs> who's who's this guy sitting next to me <laughs> who keeps talking to me through the mic? Caroline, Thursday night. Gilbert Godfrey. We're coming back on Bernie. It's a right <laughs> up <to> the- <laughs>